Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to uh, Best of Three. Today we're playing an Explorer deck. We're playing Bonifar Explorer. Explorer is the format in our empty arena that is going to be the new Pioneer. <clears throat> so I want to try out some uh, Prime Speaker Bonifar, which is the uh, Simic, Simic Birthing Pod. It is a four, four minute creature that says tap it. Second the creature, search life for a creature card with mana value uh, to one plus sacrifice creature's mana value. Put the card on the battlefield and shuffle and then shuffle your library. So basically, uh, we can just pot up from like uh, Linmar Elves to uh, you know Incubation Inc 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 Druid or, or Fibble Thib uh, and get like some things like Land War Visionary, Select Evaporation, Torpor Stomper, basically things with ETBs, uh, and then. We can stack them later for more value. Um, we're also playing a Panharmonicon to double all the and the battlefield triggers. So that this says whenever an artifact or creature in the battlefield causes a triggered ability to trigger, it triggers an additional time. Uh, so basically, like Omnath would get draw two would would draw two cards, get two lands with this one. Uh, Cloud, Cloud, Cloud Blazer would draw four cards and gain four life. Golos gets two lands. Ooze makes two oozes. This fights twice. Treachery steals two things. Um, so we're playing three Vonifar and we're playing two Neoform. Which is basically just a a quick way to uh, Van Vanifar. Like you, you, you see, it lets you do it right away. This is a slower mid range deck. Uh, it's pretty fun. I want to give it a try. Uh, it did give me the mythic. Honestly, it, this deck did give me the mythic. So I want to see how I wanted to, to showcase it. Uh, I can show y'all here. Real quick, the one right with the deck. Hopefully, we can maintain maintain it. Um, but whoops, it's right there. So we're we're four one with the deck so far. Um, so pretty good, pretty pretty good win rate. So we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and give it give you that a go. Out of here and see how we do. All right. Our sideboard also we do have like rest in peace for graveyard decks. Uh, we have Legion Angel because we have one main deck. So if we if we get if we get one main deck, we get we can get three three other sideboard. Uh, Tulsimir to help fight fight aggro decks. Tristani, if we're playing against other agent treachery decks that steal faster, uh, Tristani is, is is good there because it gives our stuff back. Like Vivian, uh, just a value value engine gives all gives your creatures flash as well. Oops, this is just a nice way to exile creatures. The, the new Bant way. Uh, questing Beast for Planeswalkers, and Vivian Reed for more, more value. Let's see how we do. All right, um, we're gonna try this. We do have a, uh, unfortunately we don't have like a Land Elves or Goose, but we do have Vivian as well. Good Vivian, I like that. Hmm. It's unfortunate. Pretty slow hand here. Would you like to see what's left of Skull? Um. Hmm. One plus here. Strike now, strike hard. As I value the flash a lot, because instant, instant, instant speed, Vanifar is pretty good, clearly. <laughs> you have to do better than that. The mysteries of life are endless. Get a white source. We'll pass. The draw card. Mountain. Snow covered mountain. Interesting. Just 
Okay. Hopefully they don't have a fiddle push. Looks like they have fiddle push, which is gonna suck. Alright. That's rough. Not dead yet. Another fable. Hmm. The thing transforms. If they pass again, I could neoform. Okay, they're not they're gonna kill this thing instead. Man. All the removals. Go blank. Elves. One, two, three. I guess Neoform. And just rely on Agent Fetry. So if we draw another land, we can try to treat two things. Draw fetch land. We can omnath, draw two cards, and try to treat two things. One, two, four, six. No. Brutal. Brutal. Like what? A lot here. Eight. Yeah, maybe I should mulligan early. I mean, it was fine, I think. I think we just got unlucky. We didn't draw any early plays. And they had passage push too. It's a bit rough. I would have had it. Oh man. The problem now is living, right? Don't think we're gonna be able to live. Too much. They have too much mana too. They're like 20 mana. Alright, that's eight. I'm dead. Main deck go blank, eh? Okay. Well, Spinner seems good. Maybe rest in peace. I haven't seen. I imagine they're playing the Croaks, but they're not very like <laughs> they'd be there without without the Titan. So like, I'm not sure I want to bring in Titan or bring in rest in peace. See. 
we'll bring her in too. Probably, probably Vivian. Starting also isn't bad. Unless we start, obviously, casting Agent Treachery. Shave on one of these. Shave one on, and I'm like math here though. I'm math is pretty good. Use the warden clicks. I like Vivian. I just need to think. I just need to like get her going earlier. Not earlier, but like, yeah, earlier or have like. Creatures come out first. And uh, Lynn Werewolves or Guild Goose or Incubation Druid would be great. I don't have those though. I mean, this hand, I don't know. It, it can be really good if we. But. I don't rely on it. Fatal push. Strangle. Thought seize. Infinite removal. Okay. The Mothra. Fire on a braid. Because they shocked that into play, which makes you think they have like a, another braid. A strangle, probably, or braid. Now they have a braid. <laughs> no braid. Okay, that's stomp then. Table. Removal. Kept their whole hand. Jesus. Come on, dude. That's actually kind of insane. It's wild. That sucks. Man, I need to land there. Not this one. Where 
right. Is the last card fatal push too? Okay. I mean, I can't. I mean, like you can't do much against this when your opponent has little every every right removal spell for the right time. That was bad, man. I just didn't fire up the Hive Mind and attack. And the Druthosis. Come on, man, really? It's so brutal. Such an annoying deck. They're killing themselves. Thank God. Don't cry. You literally drew a thousand removal spells and you're crying. Like, you could have won that game, but just enemy in this land attacking. Anyways. You had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven removal spells and one, two, three thought seizes. Like, don't. No. No, I don't feel bad at all. Don't feel bad at all. Holy moly. I feel like Prime Speaker's never gonna live. Prime Speaker survives Strangle, though. And Braid. I think it's fine. Radiant Treachery actually isn't that, doesn't seem that hot. Like, getting that getting that much mana seems dif difficult. Maybe I'll, leave, I'll, I'll, maybe I'll leave one. But I like things that can you generate value, like Vivian and maybe Ooze. Let's try that. Vivian and Ooze. Okay, oh, no. I guess. It's a bit rough. Can't play land rails. Alright, well, land rails dies. Okay. 
Ja. Uh, yep, yep. I feel like this has to get a, a green source because of the dinosaur, which gets, which gets another land. So I feel like I'm forced to get another green. Hopefully draw a land here so we can play magic. If we don't lose the game, but also magic. And we lose the game. Literally boarded all these out except one. We drew it out of our, our 80 card deck. Hog. Oh well. Yeah, it's rough. Sucks. Kinda late, but... Let me catch up mana-wise. We get a planes in case we draw Omnath. I'll see, of course. a land drop <clears throat> even if I draw land doesn't matter I wish I kept Neoform, but I feel like if I kept Neoform, it wouldn't have helped either. Okay. Cool, cool. That's rough. That was a rough one. We like, we won game two. Um, game three was no bueno as we just didn't do anything. We tried to do stuff, we just killed everything. We killed everything, thought sees us. Um, bit unfortunate there. And then we missed land drops, which made it even worse. I kind of think maybe, like, maybe if I'd kept the Neoform instead of something else. I could have stacked the dino dinosaur right for a four drop. Let's try this. Right, oh. Tap lands galore. It's okay. That's not cool. Not cool opponent. Their control deck. So get ready to have everything countered. I'm ready. I'm ready. No. Then play to fairy and the game ends.
memory. I'll get wrathed here. We'll see. They don't wrath. I'm not gonna commit anymore to the board. I'll just ooze. Ooze on in there. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Interesting. Horse. I hope you're ready to lose. <laughs> you are not much of a roadblock. Horse is gonna land there. Rip. Marset. I have just the trick for this. Brutal. Dark Typhoon. Show them how we greet our enemies. Show them how we greet our enemies. Fortunately, didn't have a big one there. My mind needs a rest. At least, at least, Vorticlake stops the wander, right? Which is what I like. Like, they can't just play Wander and Exile of clicks. They have to actually kill it with something. Like a Wrath of God. A Day of Judgment, rather, or something like that. Alright. They had one. May your blades strike true. May your blades never dull. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And Yorion. Fine. Strike fast and strike hard. They, they get to <clears throat> wander Try not again. To miss me. Uh, Feel the energy of not battle, give them priority. Then guide it like water. Or hmm. interesting. The problem is they can just block 
my Hogula, but I think I just do this. Tap this down. Wandering. I'm just gonna kill Yorion twice. I don't wanna <coughs> kill my ape. Alright, that's a big that's a big that's a big one. It's gonna help them a lot. We just need anything. Any good creature with ETB? Even Agent of Treachery would do. Not that one. That was if this was HM treachery. <laughs> Gonna be over. We, we were still on thousand things. Attacking to the Wanderer. Something good. Now we attack. Man. Can't wait.
All right. Man, they didn't cast the. They didn't play the wander. Kill my thing. All right, four or five. The bottom twice. We'll tap you down. Slowly dying. Oh, he's wizard. Also doing the Lord's work on Dream Trawler. So is Cogula keeping it tied down. Tackies. Good one. Let's slow this down. Okay. You need to take a time out. Alright, so we can get a four drop like Omnath. Kill them this turn, though. With Yori on, I built you. Hits them for four. I suppose that's how it was meant to happen. Get it. Valued them. <clears throat> okay. Mm -hmm. My right bottom is probably not that great. It's fine. Luminous Boot Moth is not. They're exiling everything. Kind of Markon's good. Bring in uh, Vivian's. I like questing beast too. As vigilance, vigilante. Okay. 
Come on. Got Neoform, just one. Just because, like, casting Neoform and they have, like, a Dovin's Vita or, uh, you know, a Dovin's Vita or Absorb. I feel a little bad. The two for one us like that. I think we're not doing anything. This is. Well, it's not good. Um, put this back. Probably have Dwarf disruption. Right? on that, right? Another Aether Gust. Looks like. No. There's Omnath. They do that too. Because I assume they're, I assume they're drawing all these. Okay, I assume they have a Wandering Emperor, so I don't want to attack with. I'll cast Treachery first. See what they have. Storm Giants. Yeah, I don't want to attack into Wandering Emperor. I can, I, I, I can just sit back, right? And do the treachery thing. Nice. Nice! There was a game. Get to play stuff. Let's showcase the deck a bit. There you go. That's the deck. That is the, the Prime Speaker deck. I, I like it. Obviously, you could do some, some work. Um, you, can, you can play so many different creatures. Uh, maybe maybe you know, going black is a bit worth it. Or playing some creatures that untap Bonifair. But I decided, like, I decided, decided to make a Bonifair deck that isn't all in on, ben, on, on Bonifair. So, yeah. It's sweet. I enjoy it. If you like it too, um, if you want to watch me live, I play decks over at twitch.tv slash If you want to see more videos of this deck or other decks of mine, check out my YouTube, youtube.com slash And my most active social media is Twitter. So check me out over at twitter.com as well, slash, slash If you want to shop at coolsofink.com, you can use, use code ali 5 You save 5% off your entire order and you get a sweet Ali Aldrazi Wolf token. Thanks so much for hanging out. Appreciate y'all.
and I'll catch you next time. All right, bye.